Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to read TSV file, or you can say tab separated value file in our programming language. So I have one text file where I have this data separated by tab. You can also get .tsv file if you want, but I have this in txt format. So I'm going to read this content, also read specific areas of this tsv file okay or you can have text file with tsv format okay now open your r studio and here set your working directory where you have this file type in set wd and within this double quotes inside that specify the directory path in my case I have this file in D drive okay do note that it is unique spaced way of pointing out to the file or directory so these are forward slashes in, in case of Windows you may find that it is backward slash however R studio will only recognize unique way of pointing out to directory and file now just enter it and it will point to that directory now here i have the data of football players so i'm going to use player as variable that will hold all the data frame values then i'm going to call read dot table in this method i'm going to pass the path of my sample called dot txt then i have separators which is basically slash t then I have header set to true okay and finally quote set to backward slash okay now I'm going to hit enter so that it can read through that file okay it will point to that issue when it finds there is some error within how you are specifying each of it okay so let me double check it here you see I have double quote And it will point me to that error again okay let me just point it out as you can see it has starting double quote which I have to remove and hit enter and then you will find that it has this plus sign which I have to remove simply by using this so use one quote and close the bracket and it will come back to the prompt okay now what if I want to read the entire content of player in that case I just have to use head and then point the player okay it will show entire data right here as you can see this is the entire data within our sample code dot txt file now the next thing to do is type in names and then our data frame it will point us to all the columns within tsv file okay so as you can see this is a simple way to read your tsv or tab separated value formatted file so what we did we used read table then pointed out to our file Right here then we use backward slash t then header set to true and then quote as backward slash okay after that to read the data frame we used head and then pointed out to our data frame variable and also for reading columns we use names and then name of our data frame variable so this was a short video on how you can read TSV file in our programming language. 